Hi everyone, so we're going to be doing another example with objects, but we're going to add um, an object and also a function together so then we can see how we can um, utilize um, the objects we set up with the functions and still console log it. So let's actually set up something here. Let's set up a function first, like human is equal to function. And what I want to do is, let's say I'm going to return something, I'll do backticks for this one. And I'll say I am... We're going to do something here. Before I add whatever that is in there, I'm going to say years old. Um, there's going to be an error for right now, but let me just set up the actual object, person1. And then we'll add something directly inside here, we'll say eyes. We'll say it's blue, age is 30, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to have some kind of function here. I'm going to call the function, and I'll just denote it to that function itself. So what I'm going to be doing is... I'm going to be able to just call whatever variables I want in this actual object here by actually referencing this information. So let's say I want to grab the age of this person. I could say this dot age and what it'll do is it'll look inside this human, uh, well this person right here that has like any that's going to be doing something with the human function and it's referencing that human function but it's also saying that needs to reference something since it's since this human is inside this um, object here we are saying that something in this area here we can reference this information so this information I'm trying to grab is the age of the person so it's grabbing the age of 30 and what I want to do is, let's say I want to console.log person1 eyes. Let's do the easy stuff first. And then I'll say I want to console log person1 dot human. And that, right now, this one is just calling um, the actual human um, object or function itself. It's not actually going to grab the information, but it's just going to grab or reference the actual function set up here. And what I want to do in order to grab the actual return value is I need to set up a person1.human but with parentheses because now it's saying, okay, actually look inside this function, the human function, and then grab the sentence that I have um, displayed here inside this actual um, function I set up. So what I want to do now is let's say I just want to run this and I'll run node example 6.js. So what we have here is we have we have console log the person's eyes and when we look at person 1 eyes is blue and then when we go here and console log person dot human, person one dot human is just whatever um, human variable we have here, but it's not actually a function because remember functions need the parentheses in order to denote that it is a function. So it's just going to be um, just a standardized JavaScript um, syntax, which will just say function human. But if we want to actually grab the contents inside this function, we have to put the parentheses here. Um, so person1.human parentheses. And then now what it's saying is inside this object, person1, look at this human variable. But we are actually going to grab the information that is returned to us by this function. And what's being returned in this function human is the sentence I am 30 years old and this variable is just referring to this information that is within this object here we can grab any value we want so instead of just referencing person one we are saying this because we're in this object already we're in this area 
So just grab this item, whatever I want to reference. So it's grabbing the age, and that's why we get the age of 30. And when we look at our console log, it says I am 30 years old.